Um, I started to be made fun of in grade school when um, I developed my stuttering issue. Um, and I've, I had that up until f freshman year pretty bad. Um, so I was kind of made fun of um, my later grade school years, my middle school years, and my f freshman year of high school. And um, I was made fun of, I started at the beginning of school actually because um, me and her as like children, I mean we're twins, so we kind of talked really fast and that kind of it made us develop kind of like um, the stuttering issue. And I mean I still have it, but um, it really started to get bad in second grade. Um, and the teachers would pull me out of class because I had to go to speech therapy because it was that bad. Um, and the kids knew where I was going and that kind of triggered the bullying to start, so. Um, in second grade, I handled it, I kind of, it was a kind of tough because at the age I didn't really I didn't really feel wanted almost, so I kind of tried to blow it off, which probably wasn't a good idea in the long run. I would advise um, people in second grade to just tell in an adult. I know it might be hard, but and it, like they may call you like a tattletale or something. But in the long run, it's actually going to stop the behavior. In um, my middle school to high school years, I did self harm, and that was a very unhealthy way of dealing with things. But I would advise other kids that age to try to find something that you like, like music or drawing or sports or something else to do rather than something very unhealthy that could kill you in the end. Um, with me, how I dealt with it was, in my grade school years, I kind of just like threw it off my shoulder and I was like, you know, it doesn't really matter. But as I got older, um, it started to hit me more. I think it's just because when you get older your brain dwells on things more and I would dwell on it and sit in my room and feel alone and all that stuff but after a while I was just like you know what um, I can deal with this and I can get through it and so I did and I think that um, kids should find some, something they like to do like draw or run or do sports or whatever they like to do music so that they can find a healthy outlet.